Hey guys, it's Gamer for 60 and welcome back to the Crush the Titans walkthrough, and I can't even believe we're already at the final episode of the whole game. This quick. I started this on Thursday night, and I'm already almost finished with it. I did four episodes that day, and I couldn't remember how many I did the other day. I believe it was eight. Episode and then any other. Or at least. Two. At least. Okay, that's actually kind of cool, because, you know... Oh yeah, when I explain the, uh, the, uh, oh wait, no, not now. That doesn't make too much sense like this. I mean, except for that. I was gonna talk about the, uh, the walls. So why are invisible walls everywhere, but I'm sure that not. I mean, that would be too, you know, you'd have to be way, way too careful to, uh, you know, not fall off. But it's the final level, for goodness sake, so, yeah. You know, why put the invisible wall, but I'll take it. I mean, they are being helpful, which I do appreciate, but it is kind of strange, you know. Okay, cool, I already got the combo cake, and just like that other level, I got it before even a minute to the level. Maybe not even 30 seconds to the level yet. Okay, maybe it might have been, you know, at least 30 seconds to the level or more, you know. Or maybe it was less than 30 seconds, including the uh, title thing, episode 20, the revenge side, or... Uh, well, Revenge side two or the Revenge side. Oh, thank goodness. If that guy caught me, I would have been angry on so many levels. Oh, no, also, what doesn't make me angry is, you know, uh, getting the, uh, whatever it is. Also, I believe you gotta take out all the enemies. I believe it's like that other one with the gorilla guy, you know. Okay, come on. Shit. Oh shit, you're a stupid piece of shit. Okay, come on, quick, 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 Darn it! No, 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 no! Damn it! He barely hit me! Barely! Really? You gotta be kidding me! Okay, I am getting tired of all of you! Being too hard on me, uh, both of you at once, that is not cool. Okay, you can't that easily at least at least with that enemy specifically oh my gosh okay i have plenty of time i have over a minute and 10 extra seconds at least at that moment stop hitting me when i'm about to attack that's really rude okay i never did that in front of you well i did uh i mean i i love to i'd love to screw you over make sure you don't win uh against me i'll be glad to piss you off because i uh, because, yeah, you can just be annoyed and then you try to get revenge on me, but instead, I go ahead and uh, prevent that from happening by beating you up like I'm getting revenge on you or something like that. Like I get revenge on you for losing to me. So it's basically like me punishing you for, you know, for losing to me. But anyways... Okay, let's continue. Oh. The thing is ready. That's kind of like the equivalent of the Team Blast in Sonic Heroes, kind of. Where you, you know, the only difference is you wait for it to charge up and, you know, attacking enemies can also help it charge up. Would you stop attacking me? Okay, thankfully there was another one of these guys. What are they called? Scorporilla. So it's basically a scorpion gorilla, so it's a scorpilla. I kind of like it. It's kind of like a burp, you know. Vomit and a burp together, and you can taste it, and it's just rising up. This is so exciting! There we go, you all- Oh, come on, that was stupid. No wonder why this is the hardest one. I mean, it's not as hard as that previous boss we did, you know? Not the one we're about to do. You know? I mean, I probably find the final boss probably easier than this mojo room. Than this mojo room. It's easier than mojo! That just sounds so wrong. Okay, I have a feeling you only earn the crystal ball if you win. It seems like the times I haven't won, there hasn't been the crystal ball there, and the ones where I have won, I, you know, just to make a perimeter, uh, excuse me, perimeter check, making sure that, you know, okay, that's kind of funny how I said the perimeter check things, I remember I heard that in Wreck-It Ralph, especially when I just said something about Wreck-It Ralph, you know, the burp thing. Again, like uh, like they said, vomit and a burp together, you can taste it, and it just rises up like it's so exciting. And, I mean, excuse me, and it's so exciting. 
all the so yeah, I couldn't remember exactly what Melby said. I should watch that movie with the subtitles. However, if I use my computer, you can't put in subtitles. If you use a Windows 7 computer, then yeah, you don't get the uh, subtitles thing. Or at least, I mean, maybe you could, but I just don't know, you know, how you do subtitles. If there is a way, I don't know how, but I believe there is a way. Either way, it gets. <laughs> either way. I don't know if there's a way, but either way. And yep, just like in that boss battle, we had to get the, uh, the Scorpilla. Scorpilla, actually. Hey, knock that off! Okay, that's actually kind of fine for me because. Wait, hold on, if I. This guy jackable. Would you stop hitting me? Jeez! Hey, you back off! Oh, there's no explanation for why I could've just used the other thing. Would you stop it? Jeez! I'm just punching this guy, like, right underneath his nuts. Literally. Oh, I gotta cut the computer mouse and turn it off. Okay, it was. Anyways, let's continue. Oh wait, hold on, I need that guy! Ooh, that was close. Well, it's nice that you two are, I mean, not you two, you few are very weak and you can't even attack a bit of this guy. I mean, you can't attack this guy, but you can't attack him as much as you thought you could. Alright. Anyways. Get Nina. Kill Crash. Is that what she said? That thing said. It's just me. Also, one thing I just got to explain about the different villain for this movie, like, you know, like what I talked about, about the, uh, about where there's, like, a main villain for a, you know, for a video game character or something like that, or a TV show where it's, like, you know, where it's similar times sometimes, you know, well, some games, it's for video games, and for, uh, and for, what is it, oh yeah, I, and for, you know, TV shows, like, sometimes there's a villain that's even more dangerous, or may not dangerous, but more challenging to beat than, than the, uh, than the, uh, one in the, in the, in the show itself, so they basically help them, otherwise it takes over the world, it takes over the world, and then, you know, the main villain won't be able to take over the world themselves, so yeah, they just go ahead and help them, but there's, like, uh, I'll give you anything, just, uh, you know, let me think, okay, I mean, I thought that, you know, yeah, something like that, anyways, and, yeah, and they even do that same thing with the, what is it, oh yeah, the second Spongebob boy. However, this game, it doesn't exactly work that way, where like the villain of the, I mean the main villain in Crash Bandicoot doesn't help us to stop the new villain, you know. Instead he was kidnapped and she won't like release him, however. He has been tied onto that thing ever since, uh, he was, uh, uh, ever since he was first replaced. Whoa! Free Jack over there, I can use that to get me my power up back. There's a Free Jack, which I can use that to get my power up back. A bunch of words of the app. Or... I might as well take him because he's got more health and he's also got a fully powered thing. Every time you get onto one of these guys, it always has the, uh, the uh, power up thing reset. And I just got to reset again thanks to that Free Jack. First I used that first one, and then I discovered the free jack in the corner, right over there, where that enemy just went down. Oh, there's another free jack. The thing is, they can't, like, you know, power up multiple ones at a time. I mean, I bet that would be kind of cheap, you know, kind of like getting multiple team blasts and telling hero so after you use one of them, then yeah, you got another use. Okay, I believe this is where we got the final battle. And just like Pac-Man 3, the final level is pretty short. I mean, it's shorter than... Uh, for this one, compared to the one in Pac-Man 3. 
and the Pac-Man World Free File level at something. You know, it has three of each fruit, five statues. It doesn't have, excuse me, a maze. It does have an enemy gauntlet after the first little part of the first. Uh, that, that not the first little part of the first level. The first little part of the. F okay, I keep saying that. Oh, wait, the first yeah, little part of robot. that. This is my level. body and my right to Fun. choose. Oh, you're good. Look at Coco. She's just like, ooh, now. that sounds pretty good. Crash. Come over here and take out this terrible excuse for a niece. That's right, Crash Ripper Button, and we'll get pancakes with cherry topping! Yahoo! <laughs> you keep this robot on course for Wumpa Island. Yes, Nina. You just shut up, because you're annoying. Just stop talking about pancakes! <laughs> and as for you, Dabbing I her. really didn't I want to is. do this myself. I really wanted one of my idiot underlings to destroy you. I really didn't want to get hair all over my clothes. But if you want something done right, well, too bad you already did. Now this is the final boss right here. However, the minion that defeats Crash gets it. Luckily, I still got her thing. And that's why I find weird is that he randomly got off. Of, I mean, that he normally got off of it before. Uh, uh, before the cutscene, and then somehow we're back on it. I mean, we're on the gorilla thing, and then all of a sudden we're off of it. I mean, I guess they could have gotten off of it, you know, before, but you can't even sit in the background or something like that. But if it stays out for too long, then, you know, it gets taken out. I mean, it's kind of nice that they actually still have you using it if you still have it with you. Okay, now this boss is actually pretty hard. I mean, it's not as hard as the other boss, because it doesn't have that, you know, laser thing, you know, those red laser things. Where you use the target. Which I've actually just remembered is that in the Wii version, you actually use the pointer for that. So you gotta make sure you're pointing in the right spot, you know? Of course, the thing is, it's basically just use that mode and then you're just targeting it until, you know, until you're finished with the move. And there you go. Oh my gosh, that was pretty close. If he was any closer with that attack, then. You know, screwed. And unfortunately, that doesn't cancel her move. And there's electric power underneath this glass floor. Dare use your other move? Yeah, I don't use it. No, no, no! Darn it! I was so close. Ah! What's worse, I got hit right after. I mean, at least I was able to grab the Wumpa thing, so I can get at least some health back. But still, it's the health for myself. Don't you dare think about uh, forming up your tomatoes to barf at me. I swear to goodness. I swear to a Cortex, I guess. I swear to the Cortex family, I'll just say that. Even the only Cortex family characters I really know about is, obviously, there's Neo Cortex Neo, which is the name of the, you know, the main villain guy. Okay, now this is gonna be pretty sweet right here. The closer you are, the more damage it takes. And if you're, like, as close as you can be, then there you go. Okay, now this boss is actually very easy. I mean, of course, it's just like the previous one where if you, uh, uh, if, if you take out one of these, you are forced to get off it, and then you gotta make a jackable again. And then, yep, yeah, there you go. No, I was right. Wait, hold on. Come on. Okay, good. Getting onto one of these guys is more important than the mojo. Really? You're gonna do that in a spot like that? In fact, I actually just realized, uh, it wouldn't make more sense if you only did that in an area with no other, you know... Of no other jackable enemies. Want to shoot those? Yeah, it didn't matter that you hit them. I mean, you're pretty annoying for doing that, but still, it didn't matter anyways. Work the feet or lose the seat. I don't know why I thought of saying that, but whatever. There's not really a seat that he has. Crap! 
Stop the laser before I even start moving. Okay. Oh, barely! Jeez. Yes! Alright! Oh, okay. Sorry about how loud that was. Oh, I just... I got really excited right there. That was amazing. The minion that defeats Crash gets a twenty dollar gift certificate for ice cream. I'm talking what? Oh, the one uh that is crushed. Oh, and it still has to charge up from her using it? That's stupid. And yeah, this lasts longer than the than the uh one from the first stage boss. Maybe not stage boss, but you know, rules. This isn't Mario Party 9 where they got stage bosses. I remember in Mario Party 9, there'd be like two bosses in each board game, and the first one is the stage boss, and then... Wait, which one is the first boss? Was the stage boss the... the one that was used in the middle of the board, or was it the one for the, uh... for the, uh... uh for the, uh... last part of the board? Okay, hold on a second. I need to sit the other way if my uh, left arm is getting kind of sore from holding me up, so I'm not gonna push that away. I'm trying to say this. Uh, okay, you know, whatever. Just sit the other way. That's good enough. So in that same way reversed. I'm gonna switch the way I'm sitting with by sitting, uh, uh, by sitting the exact same way. So it's like I get up and sit a different way, and all of a sudden I'm sitting the exact same way, holding with the other arm. Wait a minute. Oh, oh, the only thing is that oh, is that you wouldn't be stupid enough to attack your own machines. Wow, well, we got a lot of one-ups even though we did lost a bunch in the previous boss. Well, that's interesting. I'm attacking them uh, both at the same time. They're the same matter how each, you know, each time I feel like each time I hit them, and then they got uh, they became jackable the exact same time. My difference is. Uh, is I used uh, the one on the left, and the other one was, you know, you know, was not used. <laughs> Come on. Okay, good. I was able to get to that guy in time. And the good thing about uh, about this level not being too long, because oh, what I didn't notice that. Okay, thanks. You just you just helped me get the the scorpilla. Thank you very much. Oh, can you just put your ass behind me? That's really, really cool. And I can see why uh, she's not using the other attack. Because she has to wait for it to charge up. Would you stop hitting me with that blade thing? That was getting old very quick. Shit. I think we were able to uh, make that guy jack both of me. Wait, what? Oh, dang it! I got beaten by her. Yeah, well. I just love using this report. Oh, if it wasn't for that, I would have actually not gotten the uh, other thing. I mean, it didn't matter because, you know, winning this boss is more important than the Mojo, especially since I've already got all the upgrades. The only use of Mojo left is the uh, one ups. Is each 25,000. I remember, it's each 25,000. Uh, you get a one up. Hey, what gives? And well, at least you didn't completely take it out. Although you did hurt it quite a bit, maybe it was a little bit, it didn't matter because I was going to use this guy and, you know, we don't have the same health from the previous enemy. At least if it, you know, if you didn't use it all the way. Okay, here we go, I'm in the spot. So I'll make sure... Okay, this is a fine one. Okay, not bad at all. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. I love it. Also, okay, uh, here's what it is. The Arachnina. Wait. Oh, it's the Arachnina. Oh, it's like Arachne. Arachna. The Arachnina. Because I'm up in the Arachna. And then the, you know, and then uh, the, uh, the uh, last part of it. Okay, X and X. Sp uh, Spidey combo. And A, robot to mice. Robot to mice. The Y button does this. Yep, I was right. What should I say? I stand corrected. Oh. 
that's just cheap. All you gotta do is just is just point at that thing with with an attack like that, and there you go. I mean, that's the most powerful thing, you know. I mean, the powerful the uh, the powerfuler the attack is. Or okay, I'll, I'll go to that. The more powerful the attack is, the more it destroys it, and the quicker it destroys it. What the heck? She wears a skirt. Is that true? What if I'm weird? Is uh, how does he know what button uh, it, freed her if they didn't have labels oh, on it? Gross. Get a room. <laughs> There's one weird. Now we have to stop the okay, Doom I'll be quiet. So I can. Uh, I'll, I'll turn off the microphone. You simpletons! So, the you guys Doominator can watch us. Cannot be disabled so easily. Well, I could do it in seconds if I had my trans pallooper. The purple thingy. That's it. That's fantastic, Crash. How long have you had that in your pants? Why did you rescue me? I betrayed you, took over your evil plan, and then failed. Oh, Nina! Betraying me is the most vile, evil thing you could have ever done! You were a skank! I'm just so proud of you right now. Hooray! I promise, from now on, I'll be more evil, more villainous, more horrible! Horrible! Oh, and go kill bandicoots, too. I'm still going to spank you stupid for this. Oh. Finally. Let's check the damage. Maybe we can go looting. Hi, everybody. What the fudge happened out here? Give me a hug. Ew, you smell hmm. like bacon. Our house is okay. Yahoo! Oh, that's a relief. All our stuff was in there. Oh, Wumpa Island. But our stuff destroyed. Okay. Now let's go home and eat pancakes. But at least we didn't pancakes. Yay, pancakes! He just smiles just because they're gonna be pancakes. And I just love them when uh, when he has the trench pulper in his pocket. Okay, cool. Another perfect. That's a perfect finish right there. A gold award. That is a perfect finish. That's the perfect finish right there. Also, I didn't finish talking about the, uh, what is it? Oh, yeah, the different villain for this move. Uh, excuse me, not movie. Uh, uh, game, excuse me. Like how Cortex, uh, but, uh, or sorry, Neo Cortex is the main villain of the whole thing. And, like, you know, for, like, some t like for some games, they use a different villain. Same thing with, uh... What was it? Oh yeah, uh, Sonic. Like they have instead of Dr. Eggman as the 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 main villain, or well, yeah, the like the uh, the yeah the yeah the I'll just say the main villain. Uh, oh wow, eighty percent. Wow, we did pretty good. Although it would have been better if we you know won more of the uh, the uh, Mojo rooms and didn't miss that. Oh, I missed two of them. I missed the, uh... Oh, it's a voodoo doll. That's what it is. Wow. Can't even believe I didn't know what it was called until the very last... You know, one of the very last parts of the, uh... Of the, uh... You know. Wow. That's strange. It's kind of like a flare for 50 when he doesn't find out what the... What... Uh, the name of those those annoying robots were until until the uh, when he shows out the collector cards. But uh, okay, uh, did the microphone turn off. Uh, I mean, uh, excuse me, turn on. I meant say, uh. um. Uh, it turned on, I it off because we both had the all part, you know, and yeah, it can be kind of confusing. 
That makes sense, they both start all with the same sound in it. Anyways, uh, like what I was talking about, about, uh, what is it? Oh yeah, uh, oh yeah, about, uh, the, uh, the new villain for this game. Uh, like, what was it? Oh yeah, like I remember, was, oh yeah, it's kind of weird when they replace the main villain of, uh, Crash Bandicoot with, uh, with, I mean, of course it makes sense when sometimes they replace the main villain with, uh, with another villain, you know. And it's weird that they replace the main villain with a girl character, you know. I mean, I guess sometimes girls can be villains, you know, like in movies, like, you know. Like the third Mad of Poopscar movie. Okay, I mean, not actually, because Madagascar is a pretty good movie. Good set of movies. I mean, I guess it's pretty good because they got more movies... You know, than it should have had, because sometimes, like, people say one is good enough for certain movies. Like, you know, Mega Mine or something like that. I'll just, yeah, I'll just use that, because that's a good movie, I guess. A good example is it. Because it only has, like, one movie, at least so far. There could be a second one, but it may not. But maybe. Anyways. See, I like what I was saying, so yeah, sometimes there can be, like, a girl character for a villain, which that, you know, doesn't happen so much for a movie or a video game. But, you know, it does happen. You know, I mean, it's more common than a girl being a main character of something. But anyways, okay, let's stop talking about that rant, about the weird thing about the main villain of Crash Bandicoot being replaced with another villain, and instead of a male, it's a female. You know? I mean, unless it was a robot, you know? Like, a, it was a robot, and it looked like a, you know, it looked like a woman. I mean, not a woman, but a girl. I don't even know how old Nina Cortex is. She looks young, kind of. It's kind of funny, because I have a young cousin named Nina. And I'm, like, twice her age. Like, literally, twice her age. Especially as soon as, you know, what was it? Oh, yeah, as soon as her birthday, you know, came, because she'll be eight this year. And, like, I'll be 16, and, like... My birthday was before hers, and yeah, you get it. But anyways, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys before we do the finale video. See so, yep. Bye. All right, hold on. All right. Also, uh, like and subscribe. But again, only comment if you're good. And I'm not the devil or Satan, whoever it is. We're coming to you and eat you. If you do not get a good comment, I mean, if you get it, it's all being comment. But if you don't get a comment at all, or a good comment, then that's fine. As long as you don't get a good comment, that's okay. I mean, if you get a good comment, it's all being comment. Excuse me, if you get a good comment, I will go find you and eat it for lunch. Haha. <laughs> Anyways, uh, in. Okay, uh, in. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, subscribe, and only give a good comment. <laughs> Uh, yep. See you guys for the finale video.